today I'm using exclusive units only and my friend is gonna be using mythics only and we're gonna see which units are stronger in skibbity tower defense and guys we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of the month so please subscribe to help us get there but enough yapping let's get started and see what units he has and let's see oh my gosh Ziggy has his mythics he has the glitch camera man the infected titan drill man the upgraded spider camera and the valentine's titan those are actually some pretty good mythics but I think my exclusives might just be a little bit better but I don't know I guess there's only one way to find out and that's when we go to pvp mode but let me actually see if I have any other exclusives that I want to use and okay the spider camera isn't that good I could swap him out for the jetpack man or the gem cameraman but honestly uh they're all kind of not that great so I think this is probably going to be the defense that we're rolling with here we have the upgraded titan drill man who does 5,000 damage to start and then gets up to 18,000 then we have Digito, which starts off with 1,500 damage it gets up to 7,500 then we have the boom which is going to be insane to see and he does 2,500 dps but then he goes up to 12,500 so I can't wait to see how good my defense Fences. and hold on let's see what ziggy has again okay he has the glitch cameraman with 500 and gets up to 3000 he has the infected titan drill man that does 2000 gets up to 14,000. The upgraded spider camera that does 1,500 that gets up to 5,000. And then the Valentine's Titan which does 2,000 and gets up to 7,000. This is going to be insane to see. I wonder who's going to get farther. And guys, if you think I'm going to get farther, make sure to subscribe because we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of the month and we aren't that close right now. So every single subscriber helps out so much. But I really wonder who's going to win. So comment down below who you think is going to win. And guys, it's definitely going to be me. But anyways, let's go over here to PvP mode and just get started. And here we are guys in pvp mode and oh my goodness this is gonna be insane i think the first thing i'm gonna put down is my spider tv and let's put it down right here and wait did i place it on the wrong side of the map okay no i didn't that is good and this spider tv isn't he's not that good guys uh oh um this is this is not that great but hopefully we'll be okay because it's just the first few waves and wait this spider tv can chase everything what the heck look at him he's literally chasing him down the whole map oh my goodness that is actually so funny he's chasing this guy and i i don't think he's gonna reach him uh oh come on spider tv you got this oh my goodness and, and, and guys i'm starting to think he doesn't have this uh oh spider tv uh oh okay he got by but that's fine because we're still doing pretty good and wait, where's the spider TV at? Okay, he's already back up front. Um, I might have to place down another one so we stop things from getting by. I think that's what we're going to have to do because this is not looking too good to start, guys. But I mean, at least we're doing better than Ziggy, I guess. And okay, this spider TV is not doing too great. Uh-oh, guys. But I mean, at least we have two of them now, I guess. But I don't know. I mean, we're both losing kind of a lot of health right now. But that's fine because once I get enough money to place down my exclusives, we're going to be going insane. Because literally, just take a look at this. This is literally Dejito, one of the best YouTubers of all time. And then we have Da Boom as well. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. And uh-oh, guys, I still can't afford to place down anything better. Oh no. And oh no, guys. It looks like Ziggy placed down his glitch camera, man. I wish I could do that. Oh, no. But hopefully these toilets aren't going to do too much damage. But I mean, we are losing a lot of health. But it's worth saving up because we're going to get some really good units soon. But guys, I, I, I had a really bad starting unit. This is actually so bad. But it's okay, guys. Just wait for this comeback. It is going to be absolutely insane. Like, you guys are not ready to see this comeback. I am so excited. And I guess let's upgrade the spider TV here because we kind of need to. Then let's just place down a scientist. And okay, the Spider TV is doing a little bit better now that he's upgraded. I mean, he's still not doing great, but only two of them got by this time. And oh no, the nerds are getting by too, guys. Uh-oh, this is not good. Ziggy's so lucky he has the glitch cameraman because that is so much better of a starting unit than the Spider TV. And guys, I need to place down something better. I think I need to put down another scientist or something. And I guess let's do that. Here we go, here we go. There we go. We got some money this time, but we still don't have enough. My cheapest unit is literally $1,200, guys. I think I'm gonna have to cheat. I might need to go back to the lobby and get some better units because I think we're gonna lose if we don't do that. But I'm not gonna do it just quite yet because I think there's a chance that we can afford it if we keep on placing these scientists. But the spider TV is literally just such a bad unit. And wait, Ziggy is about to lose. Hey, yo, what? Hold on, maybe we're not doing so bad. And wait, I should upgrade the spider TV too. And oh no, these nerds are getting by, guys. But I need to upgrade my scientist, guys. We can't lose here. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. And look at that. Ziggy only has like a fraction of his health left. But we are both still alive somehow. Oh my gosh. Oh no. But look at this. Oh my gosh. I can almost afford to place down my Daboom. I am about to place this guy down. And look, we are doing so much better than Ziggy right now. But uh oh, guys, so many things are getting by. But it's okay. If we auto skip this, I can place down my Digito. And oh my gosh, please let me auto skip this. Oh no, oh no. Come on. And uh oh, guys, things are getting by. This is this is not good. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. 
We're taking so much damage right now. Oh, no. Uh-oh, we only have 334 health left. But, oh, no, 234. But it's okay, because we are about to place down our Digito right now. And there we go. Digito is now down. And I know you guys knew I was going to make a comeback, because look at this now. Now that we have this guy placed, literally nothing can get by. He is just too overpowered. Okay, maybe some things can get by. That's uh, 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 that's not good, guys. But we should be okay, because we're still doing better than Ziggy. And wait, he placed out his infected Titan Drill Man. Oh, no, that's not fair. Oh, my goodness. And guys, I gotta place down something else. I'm placing down Daboom as well. And here we go. Daboom is down. And wait, he has a three-second cooldown. I should not have done that, guys. I should have placed another Digito. Oh my goodness. No, 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 no. We're so close to losing. No, no, no. I can't let this happen. Oh my gosh. But I think we're not gonna lose here, actually. Because we're still alive right now in these DJ toilets. Only have a little bit of health left. But no, we're actually gonna win this. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to see this. Look, we only have a sliver of health left. But so does Ziggy. I actually can't wait to see who wins this. This is gonna be so exciting. But let's upgrade our Digito here just like that. And whoa, look at him now. Oh my goodness. We almost have enough to have his ability to. And these nerd toilets are making it by two. What? That is not fair. And guys, my spider TVs honestly suck. I kind of just want to get rid of them. But unfortunately, we can't afford to do that just yet. And oh my gosh, look at Ziggy's defense. How on earth is he doing so good? And oh my gosh, he just placed it on Valentine's Titan. Now he has three units placed on Valentine's Titan. The infected Titan drill man and the glitch camera man. Oh no, that is actually so good. Uh-oh, guys, this is going to be a little bit more intense now. But here we go. We have Digito and hopefully we can take everything down. But I kind of want to place on my upgraded Titan drill man. And I think we're going to do that right here because this guy is actually very good. And okay, guys, ignore these nerds. I think they're glitched or something because they are not meant to be getting by right now. But guys, we need to upgrade the upgraded Titan drill man right now. And there we go. He is upgraded again. And oh my goodness literally just take a look at this guy he might be one of the craziest looking units in the entire game oh my goodness but i should probably upgrade my scientist now because guys i'm kind of going broke so i need to get these guys upgraded quickly and oh no we have the old toilet coming out and these spider tvs are doing nothing but wait look at ziggy over there i think he upgraded his units or something because they're doing so good oh my goodness but guys we're on wave 14 right now and ziggy and i are both doing pretty good i think we actually could both win this maybe like it could go really either way i could win this or he could win this and i don't know i guess you guys are just gonna have to keep watching to find out who actually wins because honestly it could really go either way right now we are both doing pretty good and somehow we're both alive i mean we don't have that much health but we're both alive still and that's what matters and these spider tvs are pretty much doing nothing so i think i'm gonna sell them in just a second but let me see what can i upgrade okay i can almost upgrade the upgraded titan drill man and look at how much damage he's gonna be doing when i do that that is gonna be insane so we're gonna do that because that'll help us out so much and ooh, we should probably upgrade our scientists too but i kind of want to upgrade this guy right now i can't lie so let's do that and here we go bang he is now upgraded just like that and now i can almost afford to upgrade my scientist too and look at this oh my gosh i don't even need the spider tvs i'm just gonna sell this one and let me upgrade my scientist too boom we are doing so good right now oh my gosh we're on wave 16 guys ziggy's gotta lose soon like there's no way he's still alive here i mean literally just take a look at him he is he's on the struggle bus right now things are getting a lot farther for him than they are for me and guys spam the comments with l ziggy if you think i'm gonna win because there's no way i don't win this let's be honest my units are just so much better than his and guys i kind of want to place down da boom again but he is literally so expensive to upgrade and he's starts off doing a horrible dps so i think we'll place him down in a minute but not just yet and ooh, i actually kind of want to upgrade the spider tv i don't even think it's a bad idea to do that but ooh, i kind of want to max up my scientists and i think we kind of need to do that right now because we need to get our money up right now and right now we're doing four thousand dollars a wave but we need to get that up to six thousand a wave because once we're doing that we can afford to spend much more money on upgrading other things and wow ziggy and i are actually both doing pretty good right now i'm actually kind of surprised by that but what can i upgrade now i can upgrade Digito, let's do it there we go Digito is now upgraded again and oh my gosh he is almost maxed out i think and this guy is actually so good i was not expecting him to be this good to be honest and we can almost afford to upgrade the upgraded titan drill man now but i'm kind of want to upgrade my scientists now and guys look at ziggy over here i'm just gonna ask him how's it going ziggy and he said it's going amazing laggy i'm gonna say dang it it's going amazing for me too and oh my gosh, my spelling on that was actually awful, guys. But it's okay. But how is Ziggy doing so good? I don't understand. Guys, I think he might be cheating. Because there is no way he's doing this good without cheating. Like, look at his units. They're so much worse than mine. But guys, I kind of want to send a unit to his side. And I could send the plane toilet or a mutant toilet. But I don't know if he could stop either of those guys. Ooh, I want to send a hacker toilet. 
You know what? I'm gonna do it. There we go. I just sent the hacker toilet to his side. And oh my gosh, guys, look at that. There's the hacker toilet. Can he stop it? I actually really hope he can't. Oh my gosh. If he can't stop this guy, I think we're gonna win. Please don't stop him. And wait. Oh, he stopped him. No. I spent like $10,000 to send him over there and he got stopped. Oh, man. But wait, I think Ziggy sent a hacker toilet my way because he's right here. And look, we are definitely going to stop this guy. Yep. See you later, hacker toilet. Oh, my gosh. He did not make it far at all. And guys, this upgraded Titan drill man is absolutely carrying for us. Like he's just doing so good right now. Literally nothing's making it by. I'm starting to think that we literally can't lose or something because Ziggy and I are making it so far. I mean, wave 26, that is actually insane. But now we have mutant toilets and oh my gosh, this upgraded Titan drill man is just stopping all of them. Probably because I maxed him out and wait, oh my gosh, Ziggy's letting things get by. No way, but he only has a little bit of health. Oh my gosh, is Ziggy going to lose here? He actually might. Please lose here. Oh my gosh, if he loses here, that would be so funny. Come on, come on, come on. And wait, what? How did he not lose? Oh my goodness. But let's upgrade our Digitito and try and max this guy out because I'm literally so close to maxing him out. I cannot wait to max him out. And okay, these mutant toilets are just getting eliminated. But let's look at Ziggy and wait, things are getting by. Uh-oh for Ziggy. Oh, it's not looking good right now. Oh my goodness, this is going to be so funny. Look at him. Literally everything's getting by. Uh-oh, he's not making it far. How is he not losing the way? He literally only has a little bit of health left. Oh my goodness. I think he's cheating or something, guys, because I don't know how he's not eliminated yet. Like, what? And guys, I could save up to send a plain toilet to his side, but that would be so funny. But that's $30,000. That is, that is actually a lot, a lot. I do not have enough to do that right now. But, uh, guys, how is Ziggy not being eliminated? Look at how many things are going by on his side. Oh my god goodness oh my gosh look at that look at that look at that there's no way he doesn't lose here like what how is he not losing oh my goodness that is literally not fair but i'm maxing out my spider tv right now because it's actually doing kind of good and look at this and wait hold up hold up what is that what is that plane toilet oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh that is so much health that is so much health what do i do what do i do what do i do uh 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 did you did you i can't even talk i can't even talk oh my gosh what the heck what the heck what the heck how is it going so far oh my gosh what do i do what do i do please subscribe to stop it guys if you subscribe right now it'll stop it look at this here we go here we go and oh my gosh not enough of you guys subscribed and wait 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 what that thing had four hundred thousand health and it went through the endless barrier and i i didn't lose hold on guys i think something fishy is going on here like how did i not lose there what maybe the game is glitched or something because i swear i should have lost there and oh uh guys it says i have zero out of 500 health and it says ziggy has zero out of 500 health too uh oh i think that means the game is glitched but honestly it doesn't matter because i would have won anyways and hold on i kind of want to talk to ziggy right now so let me go over here and tell him i think the game is glitched ziggy i think the game is glitched and wait, he said, yay, that means I won. I'm going to tell him, no, 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 I won. And he said, no, I did. I'm going to say, I definitely did. And wait, Ziggy said, well, I guess let's let the viewers decide. Comment down below who you think won this 1v1. And also subscribe so we can reach 10,000 subscribers. Oh my gosh, that is Ziggy's first good idea. I'm going to tell him, good idea. And guys, why can I not type today? But anyways, comment down below who you think won and also subscribe since we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers if you guys enjoyed this video. Today in Skibbity Tower Defense, I'm testing boys versus girls units. And as you guys can see, I have some of the best boy units in the entire game. And my friend Katie over here has some of the best woman units over here. And guys, these aren't that good. But I guess we'll have to see whose is better because honestly, it's going to be pretty interesting to find out. So I'm going to tell Katie, let's go to PvP mode. And guys, we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the the end of the month so please subscribe and guys here we are we are getting started and i kind of need some money so i'm gonna give myself a thousand dollars right now and what can i do okay i can place on the upgrade titan clock man let's do that for now and that should be good all right that's a pretty good choice for a first unit i think and we already have his ability too so we could use that if we wanted but guys let's take a look at katie how is she doing and oh my gosh is that the sonar woman she seems like she's actually doing pretty good but guys i'm also doing pretty good and let me give myself a little bit more money and guys i might be cheating say i'm cheating or say i'm not i'm, I'm definitely not cheating guys but guys we could be using some other units like the upgraded camera woman that could be good for her and wait things are getting by so oh wait i guess she did place down the upgrade camera woman but guys i kind of 
of want some other units to place for now. Should I give myself a potato? Oh, that'd be kind of cheating, but I kind of want to do it. All right, let's put down a potato temporarily because this will just help out a little bit. There we go. Let's place him down and max him out. Okay, now let's sell him and pretend like that never happened. Because, guys, I don't want to cheat too much here. I just want to get some pretty good units going. And for now, my units aren't that great. So I think I'm going to replace whatever unit I had in the first slot with the Summoner Pencilman. Because I kind of want to upgrade this guy a little bit. So let's give myself a little bit more money. Like $15,000 so we can max that guy out. And there we go. Now we are doing pretty good. Because we have the Summoner Pencilman and the Upgraded Titan Clockman. Which, honestly, that's a pretty good defense right here. And this Summoner Pencilman, he's, he's a little bit broken right now. I can't even lie. But guys, she has a lucky TV woman. What? How did she afford to place her down? Oh my goodness, that is not fair. But guys, I'm gonna tell Katie, you're doing really good right now. And she said, OMG, thanks, Laggy. I'm gonna say, yup, of course. And guys, I think Katie might want me. But we're actually doing really good right now. And I kind of want to place down the Gem Titan Cameraman. Because this guy's actually one of the rarest units in the game. And guys, I think I'm cheating with the Summoner Pencil Man. I'm gonna get rid of him. And I'm gonna put down the Gem Titan Cameraman. And let's upgrade this guy a little bit, just like this. And then let's replace our first slot with whatever unit I had there, because I need to figure out which one it was. I don't think it was the secret agent, because that would be a bit unfair. I'm pretty sure it was the Sonar Titan. And we should actually place down the Sonar Titan soon. And wait, why is this gem cameraman not doing damage? What? And oh my gosh, Katie is taking a lot of damage, but guys, I think it's glitched, because I think these nerd toilets are doing damage to her. So let's pretend like that's not happening, because I can't even damage the nerd toilets. But guys, we have a lot more health than Katie right now. Oh my gosh, we are doing so much better but let's place down the sonar titan up here and guys the sonar titan is not doing amazing i feel like we need to do something right now oh my gosh should we use this ability okay i guess we're not gonna use the ability yet but you know what let's try the gem titan's ability in just a second you know what let's try it out right now and oh my gosh you see how he's doing like a bunch of smashes hey yo what that is actually kind of cool good job gem cameraman you are pretty cool but guys katie is such a noob should i send some units over to her side should i buy a toilet man ready let's do it here we go toilet man is coming out and there we go and oh she stopped it no but guys let's send out a speedy boss toilet now and let's see if she can even stop this guy and oh my gosh she's making it kind of far oh my goodness is she gonna be able to stop him? I actually don't know if she can. I guess we're gonna find out right here. Can she stop him? And oh no, she stopped him. I'm going broke. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh man. The only way I'm ever gonna feel happy again is if I give myself some money and spend it upgrading my unit. So let's just give myself a hundred thousand dollars right now. So yes, I'm cheating a little bit, but it's for the purpose of the video, okay? It's definitely fair. And I mean, Katie's also doing pretty good because the only damage she's taking is just from the glitch. So as long as that glitch doesn't happen again, we should both be doing pretty good. And yeah, it looks like she's doing pretty good right now too. And let me max out my upgrade Titan Clockman too. And now I have three maxed out godlies here. This is insane. And what are your guys' thoughts on this brand new Sonar Titan? I actually think he's really good. But a lot of people think he's really bad. So I don't know. I mean, what are your thoughts? And guys, watch this. Let's upgrade the Tri Titan and watch him change. Okay, he was just purple. Now he's red. And now he's maxed out and white. He looks absolutely insane. Oh my goodness. But guys, these girl units are doing a little bit better than I expected. Like, what? How are they doing this good, guys? I thought girls were noobs. Like, look at this. They're actually doing good. Uh oh, guys. I don't like this. I don't want to lose to a newbie girl. And wait, these cloner toads are making it buy for me. Hey, yo, what? Do we need a plague doctor to stop them? And wait, what? Why are they not taking damage? Um, guys. Guys, I think it's glitched. But that's fine because we're still alive and that's what matters. Both of us are still alive somehow. And now we have a Strider coming out. And let's see. Oh, yeah, we can definitely stop that guy. And you know what? Should we test out some abilities of our units? I'm going to spawn Astro Toilet 1. And we're going to see if we can stop this Astro Toilet using the Sonar Titan. And here we go. Let's use this ability right now. And okay, let's use the Gem Titan's ability. And okay, let's use the Tri Titan's ability. Okay, guys, maybe I didn't think through this. Um, uh oh, guys, this this might not be good. Uh oh, uh oh, we need a backup. We need a backup. We need a potato. We need a potato. And wait, what? Why can we not do damage to the Astro? Uh oh, guys, this is not good. Oh no, did I just sell the game? Did I just lose? Um, okay, I didn't lose to that. I don't even know how. That was actually terrifying, guys. I don't know why I did that. That was not a good idea. But it's fine because we're doing a little bit better now. And okay, wow, that was a little bit scary actually. And guys, is this Sonar Titan better when he's in his like other ability like how does it work i don't know if he does more damage in the sonar ability or in this normal i actually have no clue but we're gonna put him in sonar for now because it looks pretty cool 
But guys, how is Katie doing so good still? Oh my goodness, this is actually not fair. I think I need to send a toilet over to her side. But I don't think I should do that yet because I kind of need to save up some money. And okay, I don't think this guy actually does damage when he's in sonar mode. So let's take him out of that. And we should place down some other units. So let's place down the Cosmic Plague Doctor. And let's put him right over here, right there. That is a pretty good spot for him. And I still need more money. There we go. A million dollars should be enough. And here we go. We have the Plague Doctor placed down. And this guy is looking insane. Look at Katie over here. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Is that a secret agent? I'm gonna say, hey, yo, why are you using agent? What? That's literally not fair. Why is she using a secret agent, guys? Oh my gosh, she is literally cheating. And she said he's a girl. What do you mean? I'm gonna say, no, he's not. And she said, OMG, yes, she is. I'm gonna say, uh, okay, whatever. My units are better anyways. But guys, that is literally a man unit, a boy unit on her side. Like, what? She's cheating. That's literally not even fair. Oh, my goodness. But I mean, I guess I did kind of cheat by upgrading my units. But guys, take a look at this. We are doing so good right now. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to summon some units to go on Katie's side. So let's summon a plain toilet here. And let's see if she can even stop this guy. I don't think she can. But maybe with a secret agent. Uh oh, guys, she's panicking. She's placing down all these secret agents. And oh, she stopped it. Oh, no. That is literally not fair. Like, how is she doing this good? Oh, my goodness. But, guys, uh oh. I think all my units got stunned. Oh, no. This is not good. And wait, hers did too. Oh, my gosh. What just happened? But they woke up now. And oh, my gosh, these nerd toilets are getting by. Are you serious? Why are they getting by? That is literally not fair. But like I said, I think these guys are just glitched. So we should be okay. But guys, this Sonar Titan is absolutely carrying right now with his 40,000 DPS. That is just absolutely insane. And guys, should we get some more units? What else should I get? Should I get the Godly Potato or should I get the Titan Clover Man? I think I'm going to get the Titan Clover Man. And we're going to max this guy out just for some extra 25,000 DPS. And his ability is a pot of gold and he spawns a pot of gold every 10 seconds with 10,000 health. Oh, that is actually kind of good. I did not know that this guy did that. Oh, that is actually pretty interesting and pretty good. A good job, Titan Clover Man. Oh, yeah. Do you guys see that? That was the pot of gold right there. But, guys, I kind of want the Titan Reaper, too. Let's get this guy down as well. And, oh, my gosh, look at him. He is insane looking. You know what, guys? I'm just going to build the most overpowered defense in the entire game because I don't even think Katie's going to notice. And, plus, she's cheating, too. So, we're going to get the best boy units in the entire game here. Let's even get the secret agent. One of the rarest units in the entire game. And look at our defense right now. This is just too overpowered. Oh my goodness. And we'll even get the upgraded Titan Speaker Man because why not? And guys, are you ready for the biggest test? Slash Pod Toilet, Astro Toilet 5. Can we take down five Astro Toilets with this defense? And um, guys, why are they not attacking them? Um, guys, what is going on? Oh no, this might not be a good idea. Let's spawn Scientist Toilets instead. Can we stop five Scientist Toilets? And come on, why are they not attacking them, guys? Oh no. Are they gonna get by? Oh gosh. Guys, I don't think this is good. There are so many scientists toilets getting by and they're spawning all of these nerds. Oh no, but I think we'll be okay, hopefully. Oh gosh. But guys, somehow Katie is still doing so good. Like literally how? It doesn't make sense. Oh my gosh. My defense is this overpowered, but what? It's still letting things get by. Oh no. We need to turn off our unit limit right now, and we need to place down our cosmic up front. And guys, I think I've passed the point of no return. I think I've made the most overpowered defense in the entire game at this point. Like, literally, just look at this. There is no way Katie's gonna beat this. Like, literally, just look at this. We are stopping absolutely anything and everything. And let's sell the potato, because that's a bit too overpowered. Guys, what is going on? Oh, no, I think Katie's summoning all these plane toilets. Oh, this is not good. But we're stopping everything so far. At least this is not good, though. Oh, no, there's so many coming out. This is really not good, guys. Oh, my gosh. But we're somehow stopping them. But let me sell some of these units to see if we can actually stop them realistically. And oh my gosh, there are a lot of plain toilets coming out. Oh no. This could actually be bad for us. Oh no, like look at this. Oh my gosh, there are so many things getting by, guys. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? You guys gotta like the video to help me out. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna place down a potato, but oh my gosh, that's kind of cheating. I need to get rid of him. No, I can't use a potato. I'll place down a tri-titan and I'll upgrade him. 
And can we stop these plain toilets? Oh my gosh, no, we're taking a lot of damage. Place the potato, place the potato. Ah! Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, I actually survived. You know, oh my gosh, there's more. There's more. There's more. There's more. This is so bad. 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 Oh my gosh. No, there's more. There's more. But guys, I think we're going to survive with just that little sliver of health. I don't even know how, but we're still alive. Guys, I don't even know what's going on at this point. I think we're past the point of no return, and I don't even know how I'm still alive right now, guys. This is so bad. Now there's literally astro toilets coming out. Oh my gosh gosh what guys this is way too hectic what even is going on oh no 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 oh no things are getting by this is so bad there's no way i'm gonna survive this guys unless you subscribe right now i don't even think this is livable and no not enough you guys are subscribing oh no i think we're gonna lose here guys oh no but wait what how are we not losing i only have a little sliver of health left and wait oh my gosh but guys it says zero out of 500 for both of us does that mean we both have zero health left oh my gosh i guess boy units are just better but i don't even know just comment down below who do you think won this because i'm pretty sure we both tied but guys let's be honest boy units are literally a billion times better subscribe today in skibbity tower defense my friend luna and i are gonna be using exclusives only and as you guys see i have my exclusive units right here and my friend luna over here has these units too and okay i mean i guess she has scientist cameraman which isn't an exclusive but she kind of needs that for money so anyways guys we're gonna be using exclusive units only and we're gonna see how far we can get in insane difficulty and guys we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of the month so please subscribe to help us out but let me just ask luna are you ready luna and she said yup of course laggy so i'm gonna say let's go and i guess we're gonna go over here to camera base this time and we're gonna see how far we can get and comment down below what wave do you think we can get to because I actually think we might be able to defeat insane difficulty, which would be absolutely insane. I don't think anyone in the history of this game has ever done that. So imagine if we did that, you guys, I don't even know what I'd say. That would be insane. So I guess we're just going to vote for insane difficulty over here, just like this. And we're going to get started. And I can't wait to see how far we can actually get. But guys, Luna placed down her TV woman, but she's not that good. So I need to give myself a little bit of money. Let's give myself a thousand dollars. And that way I can place on a Digito over here because this guy's actually pretty good. And I think we can skip a few waves here, but I don't want to do anything too yet. So there we go. Digito is doing good. And it looks like Luna placed on her scientist cameraman over here, which actually that's a pretty good idea. And guys, I don't want to use my cheaty hacks too much. So I'm going to try and not use them. But I can't lie. They are kind of necessary in some situations. But look at this. Digito is just coming in clutch right now. Like this guy is absolutely cooking right now. You can call him a chef. Okay, I can't lie, that was kind of corny. But guys, we also need to place down the new buffed Bammy Blocks exclusive unit. And I really want to do that. And hold on, things are getting by. We need to use Digito's ability. And oh my gosh, did you guys see that? That was insane. But I still need more money. Slash give $5,000. And oops, I meant 500. Okay, but we need to stop these things. I'm sorry, I'm cheating, I know. But okay, hold on. I meant to give myself 500. So let's just pretend like I never did that. Because I mean, that is, that's kind of cheating. But anyway, guys, what I meant to do is I meant to spend some money upgrading my Digito here. And let's go. We already used his ability which is the royal flare where he shoots a beam at the nearest target to like 85,000 aoe damage oh my goodness that is insane but guys digito is coming in clutch right now but we might want to place on a bemi blocks over here so let's do that right there because that's a pretty good spot to place him and let's upgrade him once too and there we go we are looking good i'm gonna go over here and talk to luna i'm gonna say we are doing so good luna this is awesome and guys things are getting by uh oh uh oh guys we just took a lot of damage and Luna said, I know we were doing so good until those got by. And I'm going to say, yup, I know. Guys, I can't be letting things get by. I'm sorry, but I need to do it. I need to get myself $4,000 and I need to upgrade my Digito. I'm sorry, but it has to be done. I can't let us lose here. I'm playing with a girl, guys, and girls are scary. So I need to do good here. And wow, we are actually looking really good. And guys, did I choose the best exclusive units? I think I did. And I also have the Gem Titan Cameraman. One of the craziest units in the game. But guys, if you subscribe in the next three seconds, I'll get a scientist in my first slot in my inventory. So please subscribe. Are you ready? Three, two, one. And oh my gosh, it actually worked. Now I have a scientist. And let me put these guys down here because I, I need some money. So there we go. And oh my gosh, things are getting by again. I need more money. $5,000, $6,000. Oh my gosh, we can't lose here. We can't lose. We can't lose. I need something. Oh no. And oh my gosh, we lost. But let me buy us back. And here we go, guys. We are right back to where... And here we go, guys. We are right back to where we were. And take a look at this. We have Bemi Blocks now, and he's doing pretty good. But I might want to place on a Digito, and I need to place on my scientist. But guys, uh-oh. 
Hold up. We might need to do this as backup. Pretend like I never did this, guys. It never happened, okay? I mean, technically, the potato's an exclusive unit anyways, but there we go. Okay, he's gone, and we're going to replace him with a Digito. I just need to get myself a little bit of money, and there we go. Let's place a Digito down, upgrade him a little bit, and there we go. Okay, now let's get rid of the Digito and get back our scientist cameraman. Okay, pretend like those things never happened, guys. There were just some flaws in the game, okay? We're back to normal now. And oh my gosh, things are still getting by. And here we go, guys. Look at this now. I placed it at the boom over here just so we can have him down too. And take a look at our defense. But guys, I forgot to place down our scientists. No, I'm just kidding. They're right over here. And we need to upgrade these guys quickly because having them upgraded is going to be nice. And now we have this Digito back here who's going to take down all the nerd toilets. Because I can't lie, nerd toilets are kind of scary. Like they could take us down really quickly. And guys, I wonder what Luna is doing. And oh my gosh, she placed down her Digito up here. Let's go. I'm going to say good job, Luna. You are so cool. And she said thanks, Laggy. And we are doing so good right now. I'm going to say I know this is insane. We are literally doing so good right now, guys. Like, oh my goodness. This is actually wild. But I should probably upgrade my scientist. Yep, I, that's probably a good idea. But they cost so much money. Oh my goodness. I need to upgrade these guys quickly. But guys, we are already on wave 12. And we are doing so good right now. Like, literally, just look at this Digito. This guy is absolutely insane. He's doing so much damage right now. And between both Luna and my units, we are just doing so insanely good. And I should probably upgrade and max out my scientists right here too. And there we go. Let's do that first. But right now, our defenses are looking wild. We just need to save up to place on the gem titan cameraman and upgrade a titan drill man. And hey, yo, look at his little dance. What on earth is that? But guys, now we have the cloner toilets coming out. Uh-oh. These guys are so difficult to take down. But as we get farther and farther in this challenge, we're going to fight against harder and harder toilets. And one of those toilets that we're going to go against is the godly fat Bemi unit. Yup, that is the rarest toilet in the entire game. And it literally has 25 million health. And guys, I don't think you realize how much 25 million is until you see it. But you're just going to have to keep on watching because once you see us go against it, you're going to see how strong that guy really is. And we're going to find out whether we can take him down or not because honestly, I don't know if we can. But I guess we're just going to find that out soon and I am really excited to find that out. But guys, I should probably max out my scientists here too. And okay, I have two of them maxed out. And that means we're looking pretty good right now. And Luna almost has her scientists maxed out too. And so is our Digito. And I'm going to tell Luna... Your units are so good, Luna. And she said, OMG, you too, Lackey. And I'm going to say, yes, sir. Thank you. But guys, our units are actually the best exclusive units in the entire game. Like, I literally don't think you could find better units than this if you tried. But guys, take a look at this boss toilet just getting taken down. Oh my goodness, we are really taking down everything right now. This is insane. How are we doing this? Oh my goodness, I think the Digitos are just so overpowered. And guys, I only have one more scientist to upgrade here. And boom, that scientist is now maxed out. Which means I am literally making infinite money right now. All my money units are maxed out. And now we have all these overpowered units that we need to upgrade. And guys, what is the Boom's ability? I've actually never seen this before. But I think instead of upgrading him, we should probably upgrade our Bemi blocks instead. Because having this guy upgraded is actually going to be really good. It's just pretty expensive to upgrade him. So I need to save up some money. But I should be able to do this next wave. And if I turn on auto skip, I should be able to do this now, hopefully. And let's see. And okay, yep. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Bemi Blocks is upgraded again. And oh my goodness, guys. Look at how big he is. What on earth? Oh my goodness. He is massive. Since when did Bemi get that big? That is actually insane. And guys, look at Bemi's attacks. Oh my goodness. When something comes up, you'll see what his attacks are. And look at this. Ew, what is he doing? Do you guys see those particles coming off of him? That is disgusting. Like, literally, just take a look at this. Ew, what is that? I don't want to say what I think it is, but if it's what I think it is, that is disgusting. But, guys, we should probably upgrade our Daboom here, and we should probably try and max this guy out, because I honestly don't even know how good he is, but all I know is that he looks pretty interesting. So it'll be interesting to see how good this guy really is. And honestly, our defense is looking insane right now. We are on wave 19 out of 50, and we are doing so good. And wait, guys, did I just glitch out of the map? Oh, my goodness, what is going on? What the heck? Do I see myself in third person? Um, guys, I don't know what's going on. All I know is that you should subscribe. And guys, does this mean I can go through the map and see where the toilets spawn? What is this? Oh my goodness, I think I just broke the game. But hold on, if I shake the screen, maybe it'll go back to normal. 
Ah, and oh my gosh, I think it actually did go back to normal because I am back to normal now. But what on earth was that glitch, guys? Have you ever had that happen to you? Because that is so weird. I've literally never seen that happen before. And oh my goodness, guys, Luna just upgraded her Digito up here. And that means he is even better than he was doing before. And she is so close to being able to max him out. I'm going to say, Luna, we are cooking right now. And she said, OMG, I know this is bonkers. And I'm going to say, I know. Guys, this is insane. We are doing so good right now. We are literally on wave 20. And I feel like we could literally turn up the speed and turn on auto skip here too. And I guess let's try it out because what's the worst that can happen? Hopefully those aren't my last words. But guys, let's upgrade that to Boom again here. And okay, he is maxed out doing 21,000 DPS. And that's actually a lot. And it looks like Luna just maxed out her Digito up here too. And oh my goodness, we are doing so good. Like, how is this even possible? How can we possibly be doing this good? And guys, I think I just made a mistake. I just spawned the godly fat Bemi. Uh, oh, this might not have been a good idea. Look at how much health he has. Um, guys, I guess we're gonna see if we can take this guy down. Because if we can't, that, that might cause some problems. So please take him down. Oh my goodness. Come on, come on, come on. Please, all I ask is that we take him down. But look at how much health he has. What on earth and what is he doing right now? Ew, but he literally has so much health. Guys, I think this is my only choice. I need to give myself $10,000. And I need to do this just for the greater good. I'm sorry, but it has to be done. We need to do this and we need to take down the godly fat Bemi or else we're gonna lose it. I can't accept a loss here. I'm sorry, godly fat Bemi, but you gotta go down. And guys, I don't remember ever having a potato in my inventory. I would never cheat, right? Well, yeah, that's definitely true. But guys, anyways, let me max out my units here. Well, I have the extra money. And I think it's time that we place down the Gem Titan Cameraman and max him out. And oh my gosh, 40,000 DPS. Now, right next to him, we need to place down the upgraded Titan Drill Man. And oh my gosh, this is an insane lineup here. Oh my goodness. And look at the Gem Titan Cameraman's attack. Guys, this lineup might literally just break the game here. I think we can defeat Insane Difficulty with ease with this lineup, and I guess that's what we're going to find out. Can we actually do it? To be honest, I don't even know. And guys, look at how quickly we're taking down everything over here. <gasps> oh, TV woman. Oh my gosh. Hello, TV woman. I love you. Uh, Is that is that weird, guys? I'm going to say, oh, hey, Luna. Oh my gosh, guys. I didn't see her. I hope she didn't hear me say that. And she said, you said what about TV woman? I'm going to say, uh, I don't remember saying anything. And she said, okay, I'll just pretend I never heard that. And I'm going to say, good idea. Guys, I didn't realize Luna was standing that close to me. I didn't think she was going to be able to hear me say that. But guys, back to the point. Look at how good we're doing. We are on wave 26 out of 50 right now. And let's face on another Gem Titan cameraman. And oh my gosh, I can't afford to max him out. Are you serious? But I should be able to any second now. And let's see if we can stop these TV claws. And oh my gosh, did you see how quickly we stopped those guys? What on earth? Oh my gosh, our defense is way too overpowered. We have the AOE upgraded Titan Drill Man, then we have the Gem Titan Cameron, and then the Digito. Our defense might honestly be too broken, and oh my goodness, look at what Luna's doing back here. I'm gonna say, the Bammy army is growing, Luna. And she said, yes, sir. Oh my gosh, this is insane. But guys, we only have 21 more waves to go. And can we actually defeat these waves? I don't know. Insane difficulty is so hard to defeat. But I mean, technically, we were able to take down the Bemi boss toilet, which leads me to believe that we're going to be able to do it. And guys, this Gem Titan Cameraman is so overpowered. I never realized this guy was actually this good, but apparently he isn't. Oh my gosh, we have the rocket laser toilet. We're going to need to use his ability here. And oh my gosh, we're using the Gem Titan's ability. And oh my goodness. Look at how much damage we're doing. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Did you guys see that? We just did so much damage in such a short amount of time. What on earth? That ability is insane. No wonder only a hundred of these guys exist. I mean, I guess it makes sense because they are this good. And oh my goodness, guys, look at how many overpowered units are coming out right now. But this Gem Titan Cameron is literally just cooking them with his laser. He is too overpowered. Like, who would have thought this guy would be this good of a unit? Because I know that I never thought that. This guy is so good, though. And look at these striders. They really think they can get by? Well, nope. 
They cannot. And guys, we're already on wave 32. Oh my gosh, we might be able to do this. And guys, oh my gosh, this guy almost got by the saw blade door that, but he didn't make it far. And Luna said, OMG, that saw blade almost made it by. And I'm gonna say, yeah, I know that was insane. But somehow we managed to stop it, guys. And that is insane. Like, I didn't think we could do that, but oh my gosh, we have large mutant toilets. I think Luna might need to use an ability here on her Jijito soon. And oh my gosh, hopefully she notices because this is starting to get a little bit intense, guys. And I think we need to place down another Gem Titan cameraman and maybe even another. And wait, you can only place four? Well, I'm gonna place five anyways. And there we go. We just placed him down. And oh my gosh, we have more saw blades. Luna needs to use his ability. And oh my gosh, she just used it. And did you see that? That just took down everything. Oh my goodness. No way that actually works. She just literally took down every single unit. But now we have more saw blades, guys. Okay, that is not good. But it's fine, because we took him down anyways. That is literally insane. And let's place out another Gem Titan, and there we go. We just maxed him out. And guys, only 13 more waves to go. I can't wait to see if we can do this. And Luna's ability is almost back in stock. And should I use my upgrade Titan Drill Man's ability? Yes, I should. Oh my gosh, there's an Astro Toilet. Let's use his ability. And oh my gosh, I just used it. Now we need a Gem Titan ability. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, can we stop the Astro Toilet? We actually stopped it. No way, what on earth? How did that actually work? Now we need another Gem Titan ability soon. Oh my gosh, this is getting really intense. No, what is going on? Oh my gosh, can we stop everything? Somehow we can. Guys, this is getting really intense. Oh my goodness. I don't like how intense this is getting, guys. It actually makes me think, I don't know if we can defeat wave 50 with these guys. But no, with the power of you guys, we're gonna be able to do it. Just wait and see. And oh my gosh, we have these laser toilets now. These guys are pretty strong. But I still don't think they're going to be strong enough to make it by. And yep, no, they're not. But now we have the criminal toilet. Oh my gosh, he has so much health. But no, we stopped him too. That was easy. And take a look at this. We are still managing to stop everything. And now we are officially on wave 40. Guys, that means we only have 10 more minutes to go. And Luna said something over here. She said, Laggy, we're doing so good. I'm going to say, I know, Luna. This is insane. And guys, oh, things are starting to make it a little bit far. We need some more units. We could go for the potato, but wait, I forgot to equip it. So instead, I think we're probably going to go for the upgraded Titan Drill Man just because he's AoE and his range is massive. So let's place down a couple of these guys over here because apparently we're going to need it. And let's place down a bunch of them, actually. And one more wouldn't hurt. And oh, I can't afford it. Are you serious? But that's fine because I'll be able to afford it soon with the power of my scientists. And oh my gosh, we are doing so good still. And Luna's using her Digito ability again. And that is really going to help right now. Oh my gosh. But guys, oh no, the Astro Toilets. Oh no. Can we stop him? Okay, luckily we stopped him. But guys, this is getting really scary. Like, look at how much health some of these toilets have. We are literally only a couple waves away from beating the entire game. And this would literally be a world record because I don't know if anyone has ever beat insane difficulty before. Meaning we would be one of the first people to ever do it. And oh my gosh, guys, things are literally so strong now. This is getting insane. I'm really starting to think we might not be able to do it. But no, we're still taking down everything. And that leads me to believe we're going to be able to do it. It's just going to be a challenge. And let's use this guy's ability. Here we go. Okay, the ability has been used and i think we're gonna need to use another ability here and oh my gosh let's use something else or wait are we gonna need it for the astros no we're not somehow somehow we took down the astros ourselves. and oh my gosh guys only seven more waves but guys i see a tv woman and i love tv woman oh my goodness tv woman you are looking good today but wait hey yo that's kind of sus Plus, we have a challenge we need to complete right now. I need to focus on the big picture. We need to defeat this right now. We literally cannot lose this challenge. If we lose this challenge, I'm going to have to delete my channel. And guys, I do not want to do that. That would that would suck. So hopefully we're not going to have to do that because that would that would suck. So let's just place down some more Digitos. And oh my gosh, this is getting intense. There's a lot of Astro Toilets coming out. Let's use a Digito ability here. And there we go. Okay, that is going to help a lot. That Digito ability is actually so overpowered, but guys, things are getting so far now. And wait, guys, do I have more than 15 units placed? It kind of looks like I do to me, but I don't know. I probably don't because I haven't been limited yet, but oh my goodness. What is going on? This is so insane. And Luna said, Laggy, what is even happening at this point? I'm going to say, I don't even know, Luna, because I don't even know what's going on. But oh my goodness, things are making it far again. I'm not a fan of this, guys. This is so scary. And now we have all these criminal toilets coming out. Oh my gosh. Do you know how much health these guys have? This is this is insane. But if we have to go against a giant fat duck, guys, I, I mean, I, th I think we're losing. I think there's no hope for us if that's what's going to happen. 
So hopefully that won't happen. But I mean, if it does, we're, we're going to lose. And guys, look at this. Things are literally just getting absolutely lasered from the Gem Titan Cameron. These guys are literally too overpowered. Like, how are they even this good? And oh my gosh, look at how many Astros. Oh no, we're going to need to use an ability. Let's use the Gem Titan's ability there. And oh my gosh, that just cleared up all of them. That is so overpowered. But now we have only five more waves. Can we do it? I I, I don't know, but I, I really hope we can. And guys, I've literally been in this game for like over five hours at this point, trying to get to wave 50 and be insane difficulty. So I would have wasted a lot of time if I actually lose here. So I mean, hopefully I don't, but there's still a chance that I do. And if I do, that would that would kind of suck. I'm just going to hide over in the corner over here and not look. And let me turn around a little bit. And oh my gosh, things are kind of getting far now. Uh oh, we might need to use an ability here. And oh my gosh, this is why I need to be on an ability watch. And oh my gosh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, we were able to stop those guys. But let me try doing this anyway. Oh, it's not my unit. I was going to say I can't use the ability. But guys, we have stopped everything so far. And we're on wave 47 out of 50. And that means I think we're going to be able to do this. And if we could complete this challenge, that would that would literally probably break the earth. This is more impressive than literally climbing Mount Everest. Okay, well, I don't know if that's true. But in my mind, it is. And look at how good we're doing right now. We are literally just taking down everything. I still don't really know how we're doing it, but I guess it's these Gem Titan cameramen. I mean, 40,000 DPS is honestly insane, but they're not AoE. I think our best unit here is probably actually Digito just because of his ability. And speaking of that, we might need to, need to use his ability soon. But okay, I don't think we're going to need to use it here because it's just nerd toilets. But guys, we only have two more waves. Oh my gosh. And wait, Luna just used the ability at the perfect time. That just literally did so much damage. And guys, us having only two more waves, that is that is actually so good. I think we're going to be able to do it unless like a godly fat duck spawns because that would that would make me not so confident in us being able to do it. But let's just hope that doesn't happen because I mean, if that happens that we're going to have some problems. But guys, we are officially on wave 49 out of 50. And if you guys are still watching this far, you're an awesome person. But oh my gosh, the toilets are literally so strong at this point. This this is this is scary territory, guys. I'm not a fan of this. Oh my gosh, look at how many saw blades are coming out. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is this is insane. We need an upgrade of Titan Drill Man ability there, and we just used it. But things are still getting by. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What is going on? What's going on at this point? Oh my gosh, these guys are literally so strong. And guys, we're on wave 50, the final wave. Oh. Oh my goodness, if we can defeat this wave, this would literally be a moment in history. I swear, if I see a Bemi fat duck come out, I'm I'm gonna literally throw my computer against the wall. That would absolutely ruin my day, but I mean, hopefully that doesn't happen because that would, that would kind of suck. But look at this, so far we're able to do this easily. But what the heck, a lot of Astro Toilets are coming out now. Oh no, this is bad, this is really bad, this is really bad. We need some abilities here. We need to use a lot of abilities here, a lot, a lot, lot of abilities, and oh my gosh, we're using all of them. Oh my goodness, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Things are making it four, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, no. No, 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 no. We can't lose here. We can't lose here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No. Oh my gosh, we stopped it. We stopped it. Does that mean we beat wave 50? Oh my gosh, we beat easily exclusive units. No way. Subscribe. Today, I'm testing out YouTuber units versus YouTuber toilets and skibbity tower defense. And we're going to be seeing whether the YouTuber toilets can defeat all the YouTuber units. And wait, what? I just said that backwards. But anyways, let's go over here to Toilet Town and get started. And comment down below, who do you think is going to win? I'm actually pretty confident in the YouTuber toilets. And wait, what? I meant the YouTuber units. Why do I keep saying it backwards? But anyways, guys, now is a good time for you to subscribe. Because we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers. But wait, I should probably give myself some money. Let's give myself $1,000 here. And there we go. Let's place down our first unit. Just a normal Bammy Blocks. Because these guys are pretty solid. And wait, I kind of placed him in the wrong spot. Let's give myself $1,500. Sell this guy and put him right in the middle. Because there we go. He is now in the perfect spot. And hold on. Let's turn up the speed a little bit. Because we want to get going pretty quickly in this. And we are already doing really good with this Bammy Blocks. But I have an idea. We need to see if he can take down a YouTuber toilet. So let's spawn a small animal. Andy. I bet you guys have never seen these guys before, but he has 2,250 health, which is actually kind of a lot. And hold on, actually, let's defeat everything here and then spawn this small Andy. So let's defeat everything here and hold on, let's sell this and then put this guy against a small Andy. And oh my gosh, he actually stopped him. What? Let's put him against a regular Andy then and let's see if he can stop this guy. And I actually don't think he can, but we're going to find out right now. 
And take a look at this. Oh my gosh. I wonder if he can do it. This Andy actually has a lot of health. So I don't think it's possible. But hold on. If I give myself a little bit more money, let's give myself another thousand dollars. Let's upgrade this Bambi. Then he might be able to do it. So let's see. Come on. Can he stop the Andy? Oh my gosh. Come on. Yes, he actually did it. What? I did not think he could do that. And wait, comment down below. Have you guys ever even seen the Andy to us? I bet you guys haven't. I wonder if Bambi could defeat the godly Andy. Okay, let's give myself a bit of money. Let's give myself ten thousand dollars just in case things go wrong because I have a feeling they might and let's put a max out potato back here just in case and actually let's move him farther back let's put him all the way back here just like this and let's spawn the godly andy and let's max out this bammy anyway i need more money let's get myself a hundred thousand dollars and let's max out this bammy and have him only target the strongest and let's place down another one and let's see if they can stop this godly andy and guys look at how much health he has i don't even think it's possible but we're gonna find out and i can't wait to see because it might be possible, but probably not. And oh my gosh, he has so much health. I'm pretty sure he has close to a billion health. And guys, do you know how much that is? Like, literally, look at that. I think that might be 225 million health. I don't even know if these potatoes can stop him, but hopefully they can. Oh gosh, I actually don't know if they can. Oh my goodness, I need more. I need more. Come on. Oh my gosh, somehow we stopped him. Okay, that was a little bit way too close. So let's place down a bigger army of potatoes back here, just in case things go wrong. But we've already tested out the Bemi, and he did pretty good. So we need to text out... Our our next unit and here we go okay we could sell these guys because we do not need them anymore and we're gonna place down the digito and we're gonna max him out immediately because we're spawning the archie toilet and let's see if he spawns it oh my gosh look he is right there with 375 000 health oh gosh that is so much let's use the digito's ability and oh my goodness we just did a lot of damage to this archie toilet but i still i don't know if it's gonna be enough to be honest and i don't think it is but I guess let's find out. And oh my gosh, Arky is taking a lot of damage. Wait, it actually might be possible. Arky only has 65,000 health left. There's no way. Are we actually going to stop him? Oh my goodness. Come on. Come on. No way. Oh my gosh. We actually stopped him. What? I'm so surprised we did that. But what if we spawn a baby Bammy right here? And let's see if we can stop this guy. The baby Bammy. He only has 37,000 health. And oh my gosh, we actually stopped him. What? What about a small Bammy? I don't know if we can do this, but let's see. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. What? What about a regular Bemi? Oh my gosh, where even is the Bemi? What? Where did he go? I think he's just called the Bemi toilet and let's spawn him in. Okay, yep. I don't think we can stop this guy, but I guess let's find out. And yeah, oh my gosh, he has so much health. But wait, what? We're doing a lot of damage. This actually might be possible with the Digito. Like, there's no way the Digito's this overpowered, right? Oh my gosh, he actually stopped the Bemi. What? I did not think he could do that, but what if we spawn a big Andy? And look at that. Okay, a big Andy versus the normal Digito. I don't think this is possible, but let's find out. Okay, we're doing a decent amount of damage, but I just don't know if it's going to be enough. Look at how much health this big Andy has, guys. That is literally so much. That's like 375,000 health. I don't think that's possible to stop him. But I guess only time will tell. So let's keep on watching and find out. But look at how crazy this big Andy looks. He actually looks so cool. And oh my gosh, we really stopped that. What? How is that even possible? You guys gotta subscribe for that. But I wonder if we spawn a super zombie toilet, if we could stop that. Oh my gosh, yes, we definitely could. What? Well, I think we've done enough testing with the Jito. Let's spawn the Boom next because the Boom is actually pretty good, but he's not really that good. Like his cooldown's kind of high and he's not even AOE. So let's place down two of these guys. Or actually, you know what? Let's place down three. And let's give myself infinite money there. There we go. And hold on, let's have them all target the strongest. And let's start off by spawning a big Andy. And let's just see if they can even stop this guy because to be honest, I don't even know if they can, but let's use with all their abilities here and oh my gosh come on no way no way wait what we stopped him that quickly oh my goodness okay maybe it was because their abilities because they're kind of overpowered away i did not mean to spawn a bemi but their abilities are pretty crazy and that's probably why we were able to stop those guys but if he's able to stop a big andy could he stop a godly andy okay i don't think that's possible but let's start off with a bemi toilet i wonder if the the boom can stop a bemi toilet to be honest i think he could but let's see. I mean, the Bemi toilet has a lot of health. And let's try not to use any abilities. And oh gosh, they're doing a lot of damage. Oh my goodness. They might even be able to stop a godly Bemi. And I wonder if this is going to spawn the godly fat Bemi. Okay, maybe it's not. Well, let's see if they can stop a godly Andy. I don't think they can. I'm pretty sure this is the most health toilet in the game. But I don't know. Maybe they can stop him. But I should probably use their abilities here if we want to stop this guy. So let's place down another one. And oh my gosh, here we go. Let's use their abilities right now. There we go. There we go. Can we stop the godly Andy toilet? To be honest, I, I don't think we can. Like, look at his health. He still has so much. I don't even know if a potato could stop this guy, but we're gonna find that out in a second because we have all these potatoes back here and hopefully they can stop him because if they can't, uh, we would lose right here and that would be pretty bad. But hopefully they'll stop the godly Andy and if they don't, like I said, that would be bad. But okay, we stopped him. 
That is good, but I guess the booms can't even stop that guy. But what if they could stop a Strider Knight? I don't think they could do this, but I guess let's see. Okay, we have a Strider Knight coming out. These guys have so much health. And wait, look at him. He's literally floating. What? But can they stop him? Um, I don't know. And wait, they actually kind of did. What? I didn't think they could do that. But if they stopped him, can they stop a godly fat Bammy? They actually might be able to. And let's see. Oh my gosh. This guy has so much health, but somehow it's still less than the Andy. But not by much. I mean, these guys still have so much health. So if we can stop this guy, this would actually be insanely impressive. But to be honest, I, I don't think we can. Like, there's just no way. Unless we add a potato here. But hold on, let me turn off my unit limit. Here we go. And let's see. Let's do some damage with the potato. And look at that. A whole maxed out potato with 1 million DPS is only doing that to the godly fat Bammy. Yeah, I don't think it's possible to stop that guy. But now for our final YouTuber unit, we need to test out the craziest thing yet. A whole line of maxed out potatoes versus the craziest toilets in the entire game. We need to see if we can stop all of these guys with a bunch of maxed out potatoes. And to be honest, I don't think we can. Like, I don't even think we can stop a godly Andy. But I guess that's exactly what we're going to try and find out right now. And hold on, I missed a spot right there. There we go. And let's see if we can stop this godly fat Bemmy. And oh gosh, look at how much damage he's taking. Whoa! Okay, I think this is definitely possible, but we gotta really play our cards right because things could go wrong really easily. So let's start off by spawning 10 godly fat bammies right here. And let's spawn 10 of them just like this. And let's see if we can stop these guys because 10 of them is kind of a lot. And here we go. Once they get closer over here, we're gonna see an oh my goodness, look at their health. Did you see that? Okay, what about 10 godly andies? Actually, let's move that up to 100 godly andies. I don't think it's possible. I think I might have made a mistake, guys. Oh gosh. And wait, what? No way. We just stopped 100 of them? I have an idea. If we place down all of these potatoes here and then set the game speed to 100, I wonder if we can stop a thousand of every toilet in the game. Oh no, guys, I just spawned a thousand godly andies and a thousand godly fat bammies. This is never gonna end. Oh my goodness, I should have never done this. But look at this. Wait, what? No way. The potatoes are actually stopping everything. I need to set the game speed to 100 here. And here we go. Oh my gosh. Whoa, whoa, ah! What is going on? Oh my goodness, guys. I think I just broke the game. Oh my gosh. What is even going on anymore? Look at this. I don't even know what's happening, but I kind of like it. Like, I don't even know what's going on. And wait, there's still godly fat bammies. I don't even know what's going on, but we actually stopped them. What? And guys, look at how fast these waves are going by. Oh my gosh, this is insane. But I have an idea. What if we spawn 100 speedy bosses? Are they able to get by? Let's spawn 1,000 of them. And oh my gosh, here we go, here we go. Okay, no, they're definitely not able to get by. And wait, what? The game is about to end. I should probably turn the game speed down to 1. And here we go. Okay, somehow I clutched up. Let's spawn godly fat bammy 50. 50 godly fat bammies. And let's actually get rid of a bunch of these potatoes and only keep like five of them. Here we go. We're going to get rid of like all the potatoes and only keep like five of them in. Here we go. Come on, come on. Actually, let's only keep one potato versus all of these guys. 50 godly fat bammies versus one maxed out potato developer unit. Like the video if you can't wait to see what happens here because I actually have no clue who's going to win. All I know is that this is going to be an insane battle. And I think these units might actually win and oh my gosh they actually did it what but hold on one more test uh wait apparently never mind i just beat the game subscribe if you want to see more videos like this let's go guys today i'm playing skibbity tower defense with my brother but i'm only allowed to use one color units and wait he has the upgraded titan drill man what hold on let me try and send him a trade here and wait i kind of want this guy oh my gosh how the heck does he have this guy and wait, what should I offer for this guy? I'm just going to put up an infected speaker man, gem camera man, and jetpack man. And wait, is he actually accepting? No way. Oh my gosh. If he accepts this, you guys got to subscribe. Please accept. Please accept. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on. Come on. Come on. No way. Let's go. You guys got to subscribe. And that would actually help out so much because we're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of the month. So every subscriber helps. But guys, if I'm only using one colored units, then what color should I use? I actually don't know. I feel like we could use yellow for the new infected titan drill, man. That could be a good idea. But at the same time, then I couldn't use the Valentine's titan or the upgraded titan drill, man. But I'm not going to use the Valentine's titan because he's pink and there's no like pink units. But I might be able to use a red because if you look at this, actually, no, let's do yellow because this guy has yellow here. He has a bunch of yellow on him. The infected speaker man is a little bit yellow too. So we could use him. We have that drill woman that's yellow and we could use that. Oh, but I won't have my favorite starting unit on the entire game. Wait, hold on. Let me unequip something. 
I did not mean to click the shamrock speaker man, but we could actually use that. The Cupid cameraman, my favorite starting unit in the entire game. What can I use instead? I could use just a normal pencil man, but those guys actually are not good at all. Like, I do not like them. So I don't know what I could use. Oh no. A leprechaun's too expensive, so I guess we're probably just gonna have to go with a basic pencil man. I mean, I guess they do decent DPS, but it's not a ton. Now we just need our next yellow unit. And what should we do? We could do the drill woman. That's a pretty good choice. We could also do the acid gunner. And he doesn't do that much DPS, but his acid does. So we could use that. But wait, I might just use the summoner pencil man. There we go. And wait, what do I have equipped? Oh, I have the scientist. And I need the scientist for money. Because, I mean, that's allowed. He's like a Santa TV. Oh, I might have to get rid of the infected speaker man to have the summoner. Oh, this is going to be a risky move. You know what? I think I'm going to do it. I'm sorry, Infected Speaker Man, but the Summoner might just be better. So I think that's our loadout right there. And I think those are pretty solid units. So I'm pretty happy with that. And wait, let me just ask him, what color did you pick, Ziggy? I'm so curious what color he picked. And wait, he said I pinked pick. And wait, he said I meant I pink picked. Wait, what? What does that mean? And wait, he said I meant I picked pink. Oh, okay. That makes sense. He used pink as his color. But I chose yellow and I think I have a pretty good lineup. And hold on, let's click on him and see his units. He has the Cupid cameraman, the infected cameraman. I guess his tongue is pink. The summoner pencil man. Oh, I'm using that too. The Valentine man and the Valentine Titan. Okay, those are some pretty good choices. But he doesn't even have a scientist, so I might beat him there. And he said, what about you, Laggy? Well, I'm going to tell him I picked yellow, of course, even though blue is a better color. And he said red is the best color, though. And no, it's literally blue. And he said, no, it's red. Okay, you guys settle this in the comments. Is it red or is it blue? What's the best color? I'm pretty sure it's blue. And if you guys think it's blue, hit the like button. But we already know each other's units, so I guess I should go over here to PvP mode and get started. And I can't wait to see who wins this. This is going to be so fun. And guys, here we are in PvP mode. And wait, uh, oops, I forgot to equip this guy. Oops, I meant I forgot to unequip him. I accidentally kept the Cupid camera in, but that's okay, because I'm only going to use him as a starting unit. And I'm sure Ziggy probably won't even notice. So we'll be fine, but this guy's actually probably like the best starting unit in the entire game. So that's kind of good that I have him. Even though it is bending the rules a little bit, I mean, it's okay. Because it's not cheating unless you're caught. And wait, oh my gosh, two of these guys got by. Are you serious? Uh, it's fine. There's only two of them. I'm just going to put down another scientist because I want some money. Because having our scientists place early doors is probably going to be a good idea. And wait, both of these guys are getting by on both of our sides. Oh my goodness. But that's fine because it doesn't really matter. It probably won't affect us too much. And oops, we both lost a little bit of health. But that's okay. We'll recover from it. And I'm going to upgrade my Cupid cameraman here because I kind of want this guy to do a little bit more damage now. And hopefully that should be good enough because having him upgraded just a little bit is going to make a pretty big difference, I think. And that difference is going to be what we need right now. But let's just keep on placing our scientists here. And there we go. We placed on all of them that we can. But we're doing pretty good right now. We're already on wave four. And I'm definitely doing better than Ziggy is without a doubt. And I haven't even placed on any of my yellow units, guys. I, I kind of forgot. But it's fine because I'm about to place them down after these nerd toilets get by. So I'm not worried. But when I place these guys down, we're going to be looking really, really good. And I need to upgrade some more stuff. Um, I could upgrade my scientist, but I kind of don't want to. I kind of want to put something else down. We could do a summoner. I feel like a summoner would be good. Let's do a summoner right there. That's a pretty good spot for a summoner too. And having a summon ability is going to be super helpful. And hopefully that summoner will actually summon some stuff and stop these nerd toys from getting by because I don't really want them to get by. So come on, Mr. Summoner, summon something. Okay, guys, I, I think he kind of forgot how to use his ability, but it's okay because we're still doing pretty good. And okay, the summoner is summoning now, and that is good because that is going to help us out a lot, especially in our battle against Ziggy. And I think we're going to do a lot better with our units than he is with his units. I mean, our units are literally just way better than his. And he literally chose pink. Like, what a bad color. Yellow is so much better of a color than pink. And I can't wait to place down some of my overpowered units, like the new infected Titan Drill Man. But let's upgrade our scientists first, because we do need that extra money if we want to place these guys down. So let's do that for sure. And hopefully we can afford to place these guys down soon because we're, we still have 480 health left, which is actually kind of a lot. Ziggy, on the other hand, he doesn't look like he's doing too good. I mean, we're taking a lot of damage by things getting by, but that's okay because we still have 480 health still, which is actually still a lot. Like, I'm surprised. How do we still have that much? Ziggy barely even has a little sliver of health left. Oh my gosh, he is doing so much worse than us. But it's okay because he hasn't been eliminated yet. And I'm excited to see when he actually does get eliminated because it'll be so funny to see. And wait, I only have 380 health left now. Uh, okay, that's that's kind of not good, guys. But that's fine because we're going to place on our infected Titan Drill Man in just a second. And wait, can I afford to place him? Um, I can, but I don't know if it would be smart. Come on. Oh, wait, I can't even afford it. Oh, my goodness. We just need to upgrade our scientists, I guess. I mean, I guess that's a smarter idea, but it's 
costing us a lot of money to do that. So hopefully we can place this guy down next wave because I don't think this is going to do enough damage to take us out. So that will be good. But I mean, we're not looking amazing right now. So hopefully we're doing a little bit better than we are right now because we still only have 380 health. But that's fine because soon enough we can place down the infected titan drillman and the upgraded titan drillman and i actually don't know which one's better they're both pretty good from what i've seen but i honestly don't know which one's better but we can afford to place one of them down and which one are we gonna choose i don't know the upgrade titan drillman or infected titan drillman um i think we're gonna do the infected titan drillman because he came out this morning and he is brand new so i really just want to see how this guy performs like is he a good unit or not because he seems pretty good if you ask me but i haven't seen too much of him yet so i'm actually not too sure if he's gonna be good or bad but I guess that's what we're going to find out right now. And wait, he even has an ability. Oh my gosh, that is going to be crazy. I can't wait to see that ability. And guys, hit the like button if you want to see it too. Because I am excited to see that. That is going to be insane. He, I didn't even know he had an ability. But yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing that. And we can upgrade him right now. And I could do that. Or I could place on the upgrade Titan Drill Man. But I think I'm going to upgrade this guy because he's brand new. And look at this. We are stopping pretty much everything right now besides these nerd toys. I don't know why we're not stopping them, but I mean, that's fine. It is what it is. We're doing enough damage already, so we're going to be okay. And guys, I could save up to upgrade this guy, but no, I'm putting down an upgraded Titan Drill Man. And we're going to put him down right there. And there we go. This guy is down and he also has strength too, meaning he's going to be doing way more damage than a normal one. But this guy has a really long cooldown. So we're going to want to try and get that cooldown down by upgrading. And wait, look, Ziggy plays down his Valentine's Titan, but that guy doesn't look like he's doing too good because he's still letting toilets get by so hopefully we're gonna be able to stop everything rather than ziggy and we're actually looking really really good right now i can't even lie but let's upgrade the upgraded titan drill man right now just to have that extra dps boost and that is gonna help us so much and we're only on wave 12 now but somehow ziggy's still in this i honestly didn't think he was even gonna make it this far but he's doing better than i thought i think we both chose pretty good colors but i mean let's be real yellow is obviously the better color anyways like everyone knew that but i guess pink isn't a bad choice either but i mean yellow is still better and I really want to max out both of these units here, the upgraded Titan Drillman and the infected Titan Drillman. If we can max out both of these guys, we are going to be so much more overpowered than Ziggy is. Because, I mean, Ziggy's doing good, but he's not doing nearly as good as we are. So once we can max everything out, I can't even imagine how much better we're going to be doing. Because if we're doing this good already, just imagine when everything's maxed out, we are going to be doing so much better. And guys, look at this. We have like these little underground drill thingies. They look like the upgraded Titan Drillman over here. What on earth? That is so odd. But we should probably upgrade our scientists because I do want some extra money. But nah, we're going to upgrade the infected Titan Drillman instead because he is way cooler of a unit. Let's be honest. And oh my gosh, I only need 250 more dollars to upgrade him. And oh no, I'm not going to get it this wave unless I sell the summoner pencil man, which he's not even doing much damage for us. So this is more worth it to do. And now this guy is upgraded. And wow, he's doing 115,000 damage every 1.49 seconds. And that is actually kind of a lot. Like, that's a lot of damage. Especially to do in that cooldown, that is actually very good. Like, what? But I can't lie, I probably need to spend my money upgrading my scientists right now because that's definitely going to help us out way more at the moment. But they're just so expensive to upgrade, but it's definitely worth doing. I just need to save up some money because it's getting expensive. But wow, we're already on wave 16 and we're still doing better than Ziggy. I think Ziggy's just a noob or something because how has he even made it this far? I have no clue how he's still alive. Ziggy is over here struggling with only a little bit of health left, but we're just over here chilling. The only thing that I'm not chilling about is the fact that my scientists still aren't upgraded but it's okay because we're about to upgrade them right now and oh my gosh we almost upgraded all of them right now we are getting really close to having these guys maxed out and that is gonna be such a good thing once they're maxed out and look at these old toys they're just getting destroyed by the upgraded titan drill man oh my gosh this guy is so overpowered and guys how has ziggy not been taken out yet i kind of want to send a toilet his way and try and take him down like that that would be so funny but i don't know if it's a good idea and let me upgrade my scientists again and let's upgrade this one and that's all i can afford to do right now but i need to max him out so soon and guys ziggy should have been defeated way earlier than now literally i see so many toilets getting by on his side like literally just take a look over here so many of these guys are getting by i think there's something fishy going on and wait i just realized we both have zero health uh guys i i think we just broke 1v1 mode so I guess that means we're never going to find out who won this battle. But I guess the only way we can decide is you guys have to comment. Who do you think are the better units? Do you think my units were better or do you think Ziggy's were better? And guys, let's be honest. The answer is so obvious. It's my units. They're about a million times better than Ziggy's. But comment down below your opinion and let me know because I just realized this is literally unwinnable.